Tim Pool came out with a cover of Together Again, the famed hit by Smokey Mike and the God King. And the song hit number one on the iTunes chart, which is where you should go right now to download it. Now, there's a whole backstory to Smokey Mike and the God King, which you can hear in Tim's teaser for the song. The year is 1967, and something incredible happens to music. Smokey Mike and the God King unveiled their hit song, Together Again. The song was massive, charting in both 1967 and 1968, and spent 87 weeks at number one. Needless to say, America was hooked, and a legacy was born. A legacy that continues to this day. What inspired you to bring a song of this magnitude into the world? I think it's no secret that our band was effectively done, but I was, I was hoping there was some way we could turn things around. Working with my mentor, Phil Labonte, I asked him, is there, is, there, is there something we can do that's not been done that'll be big? And, and he pointed out, with all these greats like the Beatles, with Zeppelin, you know, and Smokey Mike and the God King, there are a lot of opportunities for modern versions that have not been done properly. Now, a lot of people have covered Zeppelin, of course, but no one's done a good modern version of Together Again. And he was right. And I think that's when we realized if we get this, we get this right, it could be huge. Could be huge. Now, the backstory to that backstory is a couple of years ago, Jeremy and I played our song to a sold out crowd at the Ryman. So you got the backstory and the backstory of the backstory, but there's actually a backstory to the backstory of the backstory. And that backstory is what is politically relevant. The story is that Jeremy and I wanted to cover Happy Together by the Turtles for that show. We thought it would be funny. But since it was being videotaped, we needed to secure the rights to the song, which is usually just a perfunctory request immediately granted for a minor fee. Unless it's conservatives who are the ones who want to cover the music, in which case the request gets shut down. We were shocked. We talked to friends in the music industry. One extremely successful songwriter in particular was shocked. He said he'd never heard of such a request being rejected. So we called the company that holds the rights and we tried to clear it up. They said no. We offered more money. They said no. We offered even more money. No. Finally, Jeremy, who will pay any price for a joke, offered them $150,000 150 grand just for the performance rights one time to this old song. And we were told that there is no amount of money we could offer that would get us the rights. So we had no other choice but to write a song ourselves, which is how the original Together Again was born, which is how Tim Pool's cover of Together Again was born, which is an excellent cover, by the way. Great song, worth buying in its own right, but especially worth buying when you remember that you can stick it to lib music executives who hate us for the low price of only 67 cents or whatever this, I don't know what a song costs to download on iTunes, but for that low price, you can get it. So please, if you love great music, if you love owning the libs, if you are not that attached to the change in your pocket, please head on over to iTunes or Amazon Music to download Together Again by Tim Poole, by Michael Knowles and Jeremy Boring, Smokey Mike and the God King today.